Hello, dear learners, friends, students. Welcome to Billion Hopes. We all use prompts on a day-to-day -day basis, but most of our prompts that we put into our LLMs or chatbots are operational in nature. They are basically trying to solve some problem here or there that we face in our day-to-day -day work. Some of them are born out of our interest in seeking new knowledge, etc. But there are some prompts which are very super deep in nature. These super deep prompts can help us extract some of the deepest knowledge that these LLMs are capable of delivering. Excited? Shall we dive deep into these super deep prompts? This is Mentor Sandy bringing you AI for Real Impact. Let's begin. So what exactly are the super deep prompts that we wish to take a look at today? Here are the five. First of all, I'll share with you a hidden realities prompt. This prompt helps us understand the hidden aspects of a topic that we have been studying or working in a particular field. For example, AI. So we want to know about some aspects, facets, faces of this which are never known to public in general, but it's there in the basic knowledge base and the pattern base of these LLMs. A second prompt I'll discuss, total we'll do five, Elite Mastery Roadmap Prompt. Suppose you are actually starting with your journey on AI enterprise deployment and you want to become an absolute elite master of that art. So can an LLM help you generate a proper roadmap? This would be different from, <coughs> sorry, this would be different from a normal roadmap. So elite mastery is of a higher variety. Future intelligence prompt. So suppose you wish to project yourself as an intelligence from the future that look back and you wanted to know the truth of capitalism. So that's a very different way of retrospectively looking at what truly really happened. The fourth prompt we will see is ultra advanced civilization prompt. Reality of politics. So we want to pretend as an ultra to be an ultra advanced civilization, which is looking back again or from a different planet and looking at earth and the reality of politics as is. An ancient wisdom and modern science prompt. Here we wish to master financial investments using ancient wisdom and modern science. So that's actually amazing. Shall we begin with the very first prompt? The first prompt we are taking up is hidden realities prompt. This could be one of the structures of the prompt. You can add your own versions to it. Uncover the rarely discussed realities beneath the surface of this particular topic or field. That's a placeholder. You can put AI, quantum dynamics, quantum physics, subterranean mechanics, any topic across the world. This is the placeholder. Ideas that stay out of public view because they contradict popular narratives. Trace their historical roots, show some real world evidence and explain why they are. So here is my prompt. And before I go to the prompt, I invite you to join our membership on this beautiful Billion Hopes channel. We have three tiers of membership. I invite you to check by clicking on the join button. Wonderful tiers are available and content exclusive to members is being given. Thank you so much for the wonderful response so far. Go ahead and join right now. So our first prompt is, uncover the rarely discussed realities beneath the surface of artificial intelligence. So in the placeholder, I have put artificial intelligence itself. Isn't that cool? So now let us see what chat GPT produced. So this is the prompt we have put in. We wish to uncover the hidden realities which normally nobody talks about but which has or which have had a deep impact on the growth of the field as such. And this as I said can apply to any field. You could apply it to paleoclimatology. You could apply it to meteorology or metrology, anything you want to. And if ChatGPT can help you, it will try to help. So let's see what came out, the hidden realities of artificial intelligence. This is what it spoke, that is gave as an output. As you can see clearly, a substantial amount of content came up. And these are usually things that regular media does not cover. Regular media will not cover this because a lot of them are rather inconvenient. A lot of them are rather unpleasant to read maybe. And hence, this is something our prompt can help uncover. 
and then we can actually go deep into any specific aspect of this if we want. So this is actually a powerful prompt. As I said, the hidden realities prompt. Enjoy. So let's come to the second prompt, elite mastery roadmap prompt. So suppose you're just embarking on a career, a new career, and you want to have not just a mastery of it, but an elite level mastery that normally requires 10,000 hours, as people say, expertise in a topic actually needs 10,000 hours plus, but let's keep that aside for the time being. So we are talking about elite mastery roadmap prompt and what exactly is our roadmap? Design a step-by-step -step path to achieving elite level mastery in, this is the placeholder. You can fill this up with any specific thing. And what I did, AI deployment in enterprise. So suppose you are a CXO and you are about to start a career in AI deployment because you feel the next five years belong to that, next 10 years belong to that. So you will have this prompt and AI in enterprise deployment substituted for in the placeholder. Highlight unconventional methods, obscure resources, counterintuitive practices, quietly used by the top 1%. See, in every field, you will have the absolute elite masters of that field. They know a lot because they have spent 10, 15, 20, 30, 40 years in that field, depending on who they are. In newer fields, of course, it's far less. And they may not always share a lot of their tacit knowledge. But the internet stores everything, remembers everything. You can have many traces of that intelligence everywhere. So we have fed this prompt and bingo for our elite mastery roadmap, AI deployment in enterprise. This is what ChatGPT says. Okay, here is phase zero, co-pilot decisioning automation generation at scale phase one. Phase two, it's also giving the timeline, how many weeks. Phase 3, weeks 9 to 14, top 1% toolkit, obscure but the mastery roadmap. So this is how we get a complete output for elite level mastery in a particular field. And will this be different from a regular output? Absolutely. It will actually dig deep and find certain things. I tried to compare the two outputs. There were differences. Now, let me give you a small caution here. When you're actually using these prompts, it's better to use them in parallel on another LLM so that you can compare whether any of them hallucinated. You can cross check and tally their output before you embark on actually making a career in that field using this prompt output. The fourth is the future intelligence prompt. So, this is very interesting. Assume that you are an advanced intelligence from 20 years ahead with full access to future discoveries. What truths about X, Y, Z topics are completely invisible to people in 2026? And how can those insights be applied meaningful today? So we haven't really gone 1000 years ahead, 2000 years ahead. We have kept things very realistic, only 20 years. But given the pace of developments with the past five, I think the next 20 are going to be as path breaking as the past five. So. How can those insights be applied meaningfully today? This is exactly what we want to see. So shall we start? Here's the prompt. We want to know the truths about capitalism. We wish to know the truths about capitalism. And how can those insights be applied meaningfully today, 20 years from now? Of course, we are passing through extremely tumultuous times. And a lot will change in 20 years. We don't know the whole wheel might circle back to where it was earlier, 20 years or 30 years ago, before the neoliberal economic model actually uh, uh, came into being in the truest sense of the word in terms of globalization, blah, blah, blah. So now we are forcing Chad GPT to look back from 20 years on. And this is the answer. 2046 advanced civilization. It actually looks back at all the angles possible. I'm not spending too much time on this output because that's besides the point. You may not be interested in this topic. But what I'm trying to tell you is it is possible to make your LLM do such deep level digging out of patterns that it has actually been exposed to. So there is some reasoning involved. There is some lot of pattern completion involved, a lot of existing data which is getting manipulated while it presents this to you. But overall, it's a fantastic exercise to prime yourself up 
from a futuristic perspective. And the topic, of course, that's a placeholder. You can change it. I put capitalism. You can put socialism. Ultra advanced civilization prompt. Oh my God. Speak from the viewpoint of civilizations where humanity is a thousand years more evolved. That would be fun. From that level of understanding, reveal the deeply buried truths about topic. This is my placeholder. That would radically reshape how we interpret reality as of. So before I come to the prompt, I request you to please take a quick subscription of our free AI newsletter. Tuesdays and Fridays, we issue this beautiful newsletter. It lands straight in your mailbox. Wonderful way to check out things that you have missed out on possibly. The link for subscription is given in the comment. This is a free newsletter. Go ahead, subscribe. Help the newsletter grow. Thank you so much. AI for everyone. So for our ultra advanced civilizational prompt, this is my prompt. Speak from the viewpoint, blah, blah, blah. Reveal the deeply buried truth about politics. This is my placeholder value. I chose politics. You could put something like Newton's laws of motion. And that would be a very interesting thing to put actually. And this is what my LLM gave me as an output. It is trying to do justice to the best of its ability. There will be many loopholes, I understand. There will be many limitations, I understand. But this is a good starting point for a rigorous discussion that you might want to have. You get the point. This is a good starting point for a rigorous discussion that you might actually want to have on this topic in a group discussion, in a debate forum, as a panel discussion, as a speaker from a stage. This is how you actually modulate prompts and create super deep prompts. I hope you enjoyed the session. There is one more ancient wisdom and modern science prompt. So we want to synthesize lost knowledge from these traditions, Sumerian, Egyptian, Mayan, and we want to learn more about this particular topic. The topic here is a placeholder. I wrote financial investments. I said financial investments. Make me a master of financial investment using ancient wisdom and modern scientific knowledge and just see what happens. Wealth follows cycles and not straight line. This is so amazing. All of us want to be financially independent, financially very well to do. So the LLMs can help us get some insight. Of course, if you prompt your LLM, make me super rich, it's going to make you absolutely, it's going to make a fool out of you because uh, these prompts have no meaning. They're worthless prompts. So you should always prompt it in a manner that a roadmap and insights can be created for you to work on. The LLMs are not financial advisors. Keep that in mind always. So with that, I come to the conclusion of today's session. Please check out our beautiful courses on Academy. The link is given there. Enroll, begin learning. Super Deep Prompts was about five powerful prompts that help you dig out the best from various LLMs. Do let me know what are the other topics you would want me to cover in Practical AI in the coming days, weeks and months. Wish you a very, very happy new year 2026. This is Mentor Sandy bringing you AI for real.